Hey, what's going on, everybody? Stream Car Breaks. We are bringing to you a rack pack from 1982 Tops. If I could just move this box behind me, we'd be able to get in play here. Here we go. So, this came in a lot that I bought. You get 51 picture cards. This is from 82 Tops. You can see the old stickers on here from Kmart. Maybe. There we go. So it looks like it started off, these were a buck a piece, so one to 75 cents. So Kmart back in the day. 51 cards, I'd say probably got a one in, I don't know, maybe 20 chances that there's a rip kit in here. And yes, I'm not wearing glove sticks. We learned with the 89 Don Russ, it just took me way too long to get through it all. So we're going to try to give this a shot, see what happens here. Never know, never know. I do have a blade cutter up here, but I think I must have moved it the other day. I am just not well prepared. Ah, there she is. I started pulling out a pair of scissors. So, these here, we're going to go left or right onto it. And I'm going to go down really gently just so we can get the stuff out. These are old. I was thinking about selling this to you guys in the store, but it's a long shot of getting anything super good out of it. As you can see, the first card was pretty dinged up, too, on the edge there. But these are pretty cool from back in the day. Don't you don't be picking on my hands, either, man. That's why I wear gloves. Yep, there goes first comment. Here, not wearing gloves. It's okay. Make them comments. Hubbard, we're looking for a rip kit, of course, out of this, mostly. Doug Bird. Centering this year is really hard. Junior Kennedy. Bob Galliso. Burt by Levin. Wow, that's kind of cool. Cleveland Indians, 81 pitching leaders. Dennis Worth. Romo for the Pirates. These are really nice cards. Pete Rose. 81 highlight. A lot of people are big into Pete Rose. It looks really good in the back. Let me mail it in see if we can get a 10 on to it. Oh, somebody asked me. They do make these, dude, guys. Vintage card sleeves, just so you know. Ultra Pro. And I like using them because you're not going to ding your corners with your older stuff. So not too bad. I mean, it's something to me. It looks like it's gradable. It looks like it may come back a 9 or a 10. You never know. But it's one of those, like I said, filler cards that I'm sitting there sending off groups of stuff here eventually. So we'll have. So you get the San Francisco Giants, 81 batting, pitching leaders, May and Blue. By the Blue. Linares. Some of these are really good centering on to them. Something like that, just no way. So we did not get to see a Ripken in that stack. I was not counting on pulling a Ripken out of this, so just so everybody knows. I'm more just looking for something that's really cool. It could be anything, Nolan Ryan. This is why I got the scissors here, just to try to alleviate some of that pressure in these packs. Richie Martin. Al Oliver in action. Mark Howe. Bannister. Reggie Jackson in action, but this one here you see compared to the other one, really off center left to right. Still a really nice card to have. Might go 50 cent pile later on. Lance Parrish. Randy Bass.
Rich Gossage being in the back kind of has a top left in corner, but still kind of cool. All right, so the last one here. This was thrown into a big thing that I bought into. Well, we got waxed for days behind me, so you guys probably start seeing a little more videos coming up from the good old. Well, I, this is not junk air. This is more to me vintage, but. You can see uh, Bumbry is a bum left corner down there from stuff moving. The floor. Gaylord Perry. And look at him. Gray hair and all, still pitching. I think he was still pitching, but yeah, he was. Harold Baines. Second year. Off center, but still a nice looking card. George Foster, All Star. Dave Winfield. Looks pretty good. Put him off to the side for now. Dennis Eckersley, rookie was in 76. By Bonds. All by Rod Carew. Well, I think I'm through. There we go. So, of course, we didn't find the Griffey, but we found some other hidden treasures in there. That Pete Rose looks really good for grading for out here where I'm at. Someone might fall in love with it. If anybody needed any of these for sets, by names, and there was something good there, just let me know. We'll figure something out. Other than that, I appreciate you guys watching the video of opening up an 82 Tops Rack Pack. There was not much invested into the whole thing that I wanted on. That's why we opened it. Otherwise, those things, I think, are around 30 bucks, something like that. But don't forget, guys, subscribe to the channel. We're getting close to 2,000 uh, subscribers for a nice giveaway. On top of it, like the video. If you guys want to drop a comment or two, go right ahead. Other than that, I'll see you guys for our next opening. Take care and have a good weekend.